What's up everyone, Matt here from the Tech Corner, and today I'm going to be unboxing the iPhone 8, the smaller of the two new iPhones in 2017. If you want to see an unboxing and review of the iPhone 8 Plus, go ahead and give this video a like so that I know that you want to see this in the future. So let's go ahead and open up the box. So you're going to pull this tab here. I got the 64 gig model because I was curious to see what you get for the lowest cost iPhone in 2017. Now there are cheaper iPhones, and I'm actually going to be talking about those in a future video video, so don't forget to subscribe so that you can see those videos as well. But this is the cheapest iPhone that you can buy that was announced in 2017. So I got the Space Gray model because I love my black phones, but I did also get a case from Apple, so it's not going to be black that long. So you have the design by Apple in California, you have your stickers, and your welcome to the iPhone guide. You have the iPhone itself. I'm just going to push this off to the side for a minute. So this is, I believe, a 5-volt charger, and this is not the fast charger. Even though the iPhone 8 is fast charging capable, this is not the fast charger. You need to buy that separately, and I'm not going to be testing that because I am only testing what comes in the box with the iPhone. And you also have your lightning ear pods. So these are your regular ear pods, but they connect via the lightning port because, as we know, the iPhone 8 does not have a headphone jack. And on the back, you also have the lightning to 3.5 millimeter adapter. And then underneath that, you have your lightning cable. So let's take a look at that for a second. It's got plastic on the front and back. Looks pretty nice. It looks like an iPhone. So take that off. All right. So now you have a glass front, metal side, glass back. And I will say first impressions, it feels really good. I liked the way that the iPhones felt, but I actually found the 7 to be pretty slippery in the hand with the metal back. The glass actually feels like it adds a little bit of grip, and this may not show up on the camera, but this Space Gray model looks more like a gray than a black. I always thought the uh, Space Grays last year, they looked black. This actually looks pretty gray. I like the contrast between the front and the back, but the screen's not on, so let's turn it on. So just like the past couple of years, it's the same resolution as past iPhone 7s and 6s and 6s since they introduced the 4.7 inch size. So it's the same resolution, but it does have true tone, which is supposed to automatically adjust the lighting and the white balance of the screen depending on the area that you're in. So now we're in the setup. That was actually pretty quick. I'm gonna go set this up. This was just a quick unboxing so that you could see what comes in the retail packaging of the new iPhone 8. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or things that you want me to cover in my full iPhone 8 review, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe so that you can see more videos like this and enter cool giveaways like my monthly Bluetooth speaker giveaway going on right now to the end of September. Thanks for watching everyone. This has been Matt here at the Tech Corner and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.